I'm, my name's Ben, and uh, I am, I guess, an artist. <laughs> I was born in Australia, in Sydney. I've been in New York now for about eight years. When I first came to New York, I was kind of overwhelmed by the, the place and it took me a long time to kind of find a pace or a rhythm that was a comfortable way to be here. For a start, I think there's this separation that you have between the city and nature. A place like New York, we tend to make that separation quite drastically as if there is a clear-cut line between the two. Down the streets or the avenues in New York, the sky kind of makes this interesting shape as it carves its way down through the buildings. If you turn the shape upside down, then it creates a kind of inverted skyscraper, you know? When we have moments of um, catastrophe or like re-evaluation or despair or awe, you know, you're forced to allow something else in. You know, and that's what drawing can do because when you're drawing, you're in a receptive state. You know, you're looking, you're questioning, um, you're taking in the world. Something happens in time there, time sort of slows down or it's, it's not even there, you know, you can work for, for an hour and it can dissipate. Spend a lot of time um, on the streets and in the subways sketching. I really love that idea of just getting on and um, one ticket can take you anywhere. Every single subway carriage, you know, it's completely different. You never know what's going to happen. Looking a lot at um, <laughs> figures actually on their phones, it sort of occurred to me that the drawing process is almost like the opposite of that. You know, when you're on your phone, you're being pulled into another space. I started to think it'd be great if I could bring people along with me. So when you get these groups of people who have come to New York from, from all, all around the world, and we're all looking at the same thing, but we're all seeing it entirely differently. It's a simple process that allows people to reevaluate their own perspective, but also celebrate it at the same time, you know? Um, because the marks that you make on the page are entirely your own, no matter what, it's inevitable. People often ask me, you know, do people mind you sketching them? I've never had um, a negative response. If someone's curious or if it strikes up a conversation, I'll give the, the sketch to somebody. And um, there was one time I, I I just randomly gave it to somebody and um, she said it was the best uh, birthday present she ever had. Mm -hmm.